welcome back to my channel so as you saw in the title this is our 2.5 episode that i promise so today at the end of the episode we would have mastered our air verbs so let's start off with some vocabularies that we're going to be needing for today so take your cuaderno y pluma for our vocabularies okay first off we have musica that is music la ropa that is clothes we have la pregunta, that is the question. La casa, that is the house. La, la sala, that is the living room. El numero de teléfono, that is the telephone number. Let's go to our verbs. So for the verbs that we're going to use today, this are, first off, we have pagar, that is to pay. We have contestar, that is to answer. Preguntar, to ask. Limpiar, to clean. Estudiar, to study. Cantar, to sing. Entrar, to enter. Llamar, to call. Trabajar, to work. Bailar, to dance. Escuchar, to listen. Cambiar, to change. So these are the few of the air verbs that I chose to, that we're going to be using in today's uh, mastering of our air verbs. There are a lot of air verbs that we have there, so you can check it out online. It's always available online, of course. And for today, for mastering our air verbs, I chose these verbs that we're going to conjugate. So if you're ready, um, let's go on to the review of the pattern that I've given you the last time. I hope you memorize it. Also, our pronouns. I hope you memorize our pronouns. So, let's review. The, of course, we'll have the chart. So, on this part, we have O, A, S, A, Amos. We have Ais, A, N. So, again, that's O, A, S, A, Amos, Ais, A, N. Uh, any. Hope you memorize that. So, let's start off with pagar. Pagar is to pay. So, as we have um, as we have discussed, take off this AR part, and we're left with pe-a-he. So, how do I say I pay? This is very common, actually in the call center industry for billing accounts or i use this regularly in my you know calls so how do i say i pay i pay the bill to conjugate pagar es pago will be yo pago la cuenta following so far it's simple yo pago la cuenta what if you say, you pay the bill? Tu pagas la cuenta. He pays the bill. El paga la cuenta. I hope you're following so far. Now we go to our plural form. So that is, nosotros pagamos la cuenta. Vosotros pagáis la cuenta. Ellos pagan la cuenta o ellas pagan la cuenta. Of course, we should not forget our usted form. So for here, that is, usted paga la cuenta, ustedes pagan la cuenta. Now, of course, um, in, my, in my work, I always use the usted form because this is to show respect to all our customers. So I use this part, the, the usted form. So I will always say, Usted paga la cuenta. Let's move on to the verbs that goes together. It's like the question and answer in English. So to clarify, um, to avoid confusion, the word la pregunta is the noun form, which is the question. The verb form is preguntar, which is to ask, and then contestar is to answer. So let's conjugate preguntar. So when I say I ask, I would say yo pregunto, tú preguntas, ella pregunta, 
él pregunta, usted pregunta, nosotros preguntamos, vosotros preguntáis, ellos preguntan, ustedes preguntan, ellas preguntan. Let's go to the answer part. So, contestar is to answer and to conjugate it is um, contesto, contestas, contesta, contestamos, contestáis, contestan. See, if you memorize it and you know it by heart, it's easy to conjugate uh, the verb. So, how would I say I answer the question? Is contesto la pregunta. You can put the yo, like what I've said earlier in our discussions. You don't have to put the yo. You can just simply say, contesto la pregunta. Tú contestas la pregunta. Contesta la pregunta. Contestamos la pregunta. Contestáis la pregunta. Contestan la pregunta. So let's go to the verb limpiar. Limpiar is to clean. So how do I say I clean the house? That's gonna be yo limpio la casa. Tú limpias la casa. Él limpia la casa. Nosotros limpiamos la casa. Vosotros limpiáis la casa. Ellos limpian la casa. Go to the verb cantar, which is to sing. I would like to give you an additional vocabulary for today. A song in Spanish is una canción. Again, that's una canción. So, cantar is to sing. How do I say I sing a song? Let's conjugate that. That will be... Yo canto una canción. You sing a song. Tú cantas una canción. Él canta una canción. Nosotros cantamos una canción. Vosotros cantáis una canción. Ustedes o ellos cantan una canción. Let's move on to the verb cambiar. Cambiar is to change. So, how do I say I change clothes? That would be cambio la ropa. Tú cambias la ropa. Él cambia la ropa. Nosotros cambiamos la ropa. Vosotros cambiáis la ropa. Ellos cambian la ropa. So let's go to the verb entrar or to enter. So to conjugate enter, uh, that will be take off the AR. So how do I say I enter the living room? Yo entro la sala. Tu entras la sala. Ella entra la sala. Nosotros entramos la sala. Vosotros entráis la sala. Ellos entran la sala. So let's conjugate estudiar, which is to study. How do I say I study Spanish? That would be estudio español. Estudiáis español. Estudia español. Estudiamos español. Estudiáis español. Estudian español. Conjugate. Yamar, which is to call. So how do I say I call the telephone number? That will be yo llamo el número de teléfono. Tu llamas el número de teléfono. El llama una número de teléfono. Nosotros llamamos el número de teléfono. Vosotros llamáis el número de teléfono. Ellos llaman el número de teléfono. So let's go to the word trabajar, which is to work. I'll give you an additional vocabulary for this. Office is oficina. So how do I say I work in the office? That would be, yo trabajo en la oficina. Tú trabajas en la oficina. Él trabaja un 
oficina, en la oficina. Nosotros trabajamos en la oficina. Vosotros trabajáis en la oficina. Ellos trabajan en la oficina. Conjugate the word escuchar, which is to listen. And how do I say I listen to music? That would be escucho la música. Then, tú escuchas la música. Él escucha la música. Nosotros escuchamos la música. Vosotros escucháis la música. Ellos escuchan la música. Our usted form, of course. Usted escucha la música. Ustedes escuchan la música. The last verb that we're going to conjugate today is the word ayudar or to help. So how do I say I help a friend? That would be ayudo una amiga if it's female. Ayudo un amigo if it's male. Tú ayudas una amiga. Él ayuda una amiga. Nosotros ayudamos una amiga. Vosotros ayudáis una amiga. Ellos ayudan una amiga. So these are the example of our air verbs. These are a few examples of our air verbs. If you want to look more, um, search it online. We have available tons of air verbs online that you can use and practice on. So, this is it for our air verbs. I hope you mastered it with our examples today. Um, hasta luego. Uh, don't forget to click on subscribe, like, turn on your post notification so that you will be notified if I have posted a video. So, adios amigos. Hasta la vista.